All right, the most important thing that you need here for your Mega Squirt or Mega Squirt 2 setup is all the documentation that you can come upon. Uh, internet, the forums, and of course all the printed media. And if you uh, can't find it in one place, just keep looking. There's a ton of information out there. Um, as well, I've bought practically everything uh, from Do-It-Yourself Auto-Tune and um, they've just been terrific helping me out. I'm a complete novice at this and uh, I'm into computers but as far as fuel injection and configuring Megatune and Megasquirt they've been super helpful. Soldering together the computer wasn't so hard. I did have some questions about setting the firmware uh, according to the uh, CPU but uh, again um, they're very just helpful. An email will fix it up. What I want to show you right now is uh, something else really cool. Uh, when I converted my Jeep YJ with a straight six, um, one thing I couldn't find on the internet just was how to convert my tachometer. I don't want to spend a hundred bucks or even fifty bucks on a tachometer. So with a little hunting around, what I did find was some source code or programs that you can download and at least log and use for real-time display on a Palm Pilot. So I bought 10 of them. Each one cost me about $4. I bought a lot of 10. And this is what you get when you turn it on. Alright, so the engine's running. Turn it on here. Here's Palm Log. It's a fabulous piece of software written by a few fellows I haven't written and said thank you to yet. Um, all the real-time data is here and uh, what I'm going to do is just go through the displays and I'm going to uh, mount the Palm um, just on the front dash here, maybe somewhere over here. And the display is very easy to read in the bright light, and as you can see, I have a new tachometer, and it cost me $10. So, uh, a lot of other data there. Um, what I'm going to do is bring up um, one for coolant temperature, and let me show you how to do that. It's not that tough. I don't even know if I've got the camera on it, but let me try. Just tap the display. Exhaust gas correction percent, air correction, warm up. RPM, acceleration, all the variables, but the one I'm looking for is coolant temperature, and we're going to be getting, there we are. So according to this, the engine is 170 degrees, and um, I think it's just a fabulous little glass display that we can mount in the unit, and uh, it won't be in the way of anything, and I'll have uh, something pretty neat. So, there we are, a uh, 4 or $5 dollar Palm Pilot using uh, some free Palm Log software and a cable, oh you can buy these cables on the internet for $6 or so, I just rewired it so um, um, the null modem capabilities are, uh, are just taking care of it uh, right internally rather than using an adapter.